Monday substantially reopened to foreign tourists some 18 months after effectively closing its borders against the coronavirus, raising hopes of economic revival in a country more dependent than most on the spending power of overseas visitors. A steady stream of inbound passengers bustled through Bangkok International Airport, previously almost deserted public areas. Fully vaccinated tourists from 63 countries and territories can now fly in with minimal conditions. They take a COVID test on arrival and spend one night in a designated hotel awaiting the result. If their test is negative, they are free to leave and enjoy their stay unhindered. With crowds of tourists absent from the streets, it's been a desperate time for Thailand's vast hospitality sector. It accounted for an estimated 12 until 20 percent of its GDP before the coronavirus pandemic. And now moving on to China, where Chinese health authorities have implemented a total lockdown due to the new wave of COVID-19 virus in Ejin Banner in the Mongolia Autonomic Area and Lanzhou City in the Gansu province. Beijing city government has strengthened its prevention and control measures relating to new cases found in Gansu province and the internal Mongolia Autonomic Region. Since the new virus were detected, 43 new COVID cases from local residents has emerged. Over 9,000 tourists were previously left stranded at Ejin Banner. The city of Lanzhou also went into lockdown since last Monday after 45 new cases of COVID from local residents. The government of Gansu province are strictly checking everyone entering in and out of its residential area. Beijing health authority detected 21 local residents in three districts from Fengtai, Changping, and Haidian have confirmed positive for COVID. Local health authorities held a massive PCR testing against its 1.56 million citizens.